more. So as per your request in the community's poll, the big item people wanted me to do this holiday season were DIY gift ideas. So this week I've come up with a couple of ideas for our friends or family that are not only incredibly cheap to make, but it will take you like no time whatsoever. It's super simple. It's like two, three ingredients and uh, I love the way that it turned out. So all you're really going to need is a few items from the dollar store and essential oils or some fragrance oils. You can get really cute bottles and glassware at the dollar store. These were each $1.25. This again is also from the dollar store. It's $1.25 and it's just a plain Epsom salt. The only other thing you're going to need are your essential oils for this. So I'm going to start out with one cup. So because I'm doing this uh, for the holidays, I figured I'd kind of go with some holiday kind of scents. So I have a uh, citrus, citrus here, and I'm just going to start by adding a couple of drops. Nine, ten, for one cup. And then you can mix those around. So because I'm gonna try and make like a little bit of a candy cane color, um, I'm gonna keep this one white. Now that we have it all mixed in, it smells amazing right now. So that one's good and I'll set that aside. And this bowl only has half a cup in it and I'm going to add a cranberry to it. Whoa, that came out like crazy so. <laughs> And because it is cranberry, I'm going to add a little bit of food coloring. Now you want to be pretty light on the food coloring, so I'm going to start with, I think, just one drop. And we'll see how this all gets mixed together and what the color looks like. See, you don't need a whole lot of color. This almost looks a little orange, though. I think I might add just one more drop. See if we can make it a little more red. And this is totally an unnecessary step, but I think it's gonna look a lot cuter when you put it in the bottles for whoever you're giving this to. Help me fill this. So I'm kind of just making a little funnel here. I'm just going to fill it up. Oh gosh, I feel like this is gonna go poorly. Maybe I should get another spoon. <laughs> you'll need to do for this gift is then just give it a cute little label which I'll show you how I do after. The other scent that I'm gonna do is um, uh, cinnamon and again you probably want to use around 10 drops of essential oil per cup. You can use probably upwards of 15 drops too. I am going to add a little bit of yellow for color starting with just one drop. Do lots of great fun fragrances, fun colors, get funky with layering the bottles like I did last time. And this is such a cheap and easy gift for somebody and totally like a relaxing one too. Okay, so my other idea also you can get some of these products at the dollar store this is like a travel sized bag. I bought it because I want this spray bottle in here. You might be able to find a nicer looking spray bottle than this uh, and maybe made out of real glass but essentially we're going to make a little bathroom fragrance spray so we needed this portion of the bottle and I'm just going to use this as well. All you really need to do is fill this with distilled water and then again you're going to add either your uh, essential oils or your fragrance oils. It's going to go ahead and add five drops. Oh. There's a lot in there. Okay, so I decided to add some food coloring to this one as well because it is a spiced berry. I figured red would probably make sense in there. Not sure how much I'm gonna want. So we'll just mix that up. Because it's a clear bottle, I just think it looks 
a little better when it's a color. Presentation. Okay, so these are just some plain white stickers that I picked up at the dollar store and I kind of drew my own label. If you had a printer or a better option, you could do that. And uh, this is just so everybody knows what's on it. I'm gonna cut this sticker to be a little bit smaller. Slap your label on. And so yeah, I think these labels put a real personal touch on these, but also kind of give it a real finished look and totally make it look like a homemade gift, which it is, but like a really thoughtful gift. You can do a ton of this if you have a lot of friends or family to gift for. And when I think about it, oftentimes like lotions and, and bubble baths and things like that are a super common gift for the holidays and that's one that you can DIY for next to nothing. So let me know if you enjoyed this uh, gift idea. I do have plenty of other gift ideas on my channel as well that I've done in previous years or just a lot of the DIYs I've made could make great gifts so feel free to look around but if you enjoyed this video give the video a like and if you try it send me some photos of your diy gifts you can follow me on instagram and on twitter at janelle steeper don't forget to tag me in those photos so i can check them out and don't forget to subscribe i'll be back next wednesday with a new diy cheers <laughs>